Conferência de imprensa com Elia Zimmer, o primeiro finalista do All Eras Open 4. Elias, congrats for being in the final. A good match for you, success swing. How are you feeling? Uh, very good. I think it was a very good match. I was playing like how I wanted to play. I did some changes from yesterday and uh, I think it worked very well. The first set, especially it wasn't easy, you were 4 5 down after being a breakup, I think. What was the key for you to, to turn it around? Uh, I think against him you have to be careful with because I think he's better when he's returning than when he's serving. So I, uh, I lost a little bit of focus and uh, it went so quick that at 5 4 I regrouped and uh, then I, when I found the rhythm I felt like I was in control. But then in the second set it felt like you had it in control, did you feel it too? How was it to, to understand that it was maybe losing a little bit of the, of the blocks? No, I mean, I felt like uh, I was uh, second, that's what I said. In the second set, I really started to play well. I started to hit my shot big and uh, I hit some winners that I'm going to watch later on the replay of the match, which I really like. And uh, I mean, let's keep it going for tomorrow. And tomorrow is a big match, it's a final. I haven't played final in a long time, so I look forward to it. What do you know about? Um your future opponents uh, from the, the match for each other? Uh, I was training every day with Faria here and I told him the first day we're gonna go to Paris tomorrow uh, <laughs> after the final and now when I saw him I told him listen man one match away so uh, it's, he's a nice guy I get along with all the Portuguese players and uh, I mean Burchag is a good player too he's every week solid so I mean I think they have to be more careful about my game than I about theirs. It's funny that you mention that because usually players wouldn't like to, to face a, a player from the country where it's happening. You don't mind playing Portuguese in final if that's the case? No, I mean, I mean, he's on the yeah, he's that. So he's, the, <laughs> he's the main guy. So <laughs> let's see. But he's a nice guy. I get along very well with him, and I know Pedro as well. He have been playing on the tour with him all the years, so. It's going to be, a, whoever it is, it's going to be a good final. I'm just really looking forward to the final. First final in two years, I think even a little bit more than that. How does it feel to, to be back? Uh, it feels good. I mean, this week uh, I've been, I was working very, very good in a good way, in a structured way. So uh, I felt some good things could come. and. Uh, you know, sooner or later, if you put in the work, it's going to pay off. So I'm very happy and uh, I have one match left and I want to leave Portugal with the trophy. Yes, congratulations on, on reaching the final. The last time you were here, I think you had several match points in that court. So is it good for you to like get a revenge from that week you being in the final? Yeah, funny you mentioned that because even though last the last time I felt like you know, sometimes you come to the places and you have a good feeling. And uh, I, I was, if I didn't lose that match against uh, Komasanya, I think I would have won the tournament as well. He won? I, I, he won it, yeah. you know, so I was like, okay, it's your turn. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, I, and I said, I had it in my plan. I was gonna play that week and I was gonna come back here before Ragaro. So it was, I had already planned it on my schedule. So I have a good feeling here and uh, everything fits me well. And. Uh, yeah, I, I think, I mean, I'm in the final now, so I live in the present, so let's go now. Yeah, I don't know if we, it was in that tournament or the tournament before that in Portugal, but I saw you with a Portuguese coach, uh, Leonardo Tavares. So uh, can you tell us a little bit how that relationship went? Uh, did you enjoy all the process went with, with Leonardo? Are you friendly? with him? Are you guys friends? Uh, can you tell us a little bit? Yeah, we did a, we did a, a trial period. We did, uh, I think, one week in Stockholm and then Australia. But uh, it was uh, we stopped after Australia, so we didn't continue. But he's a very nice guy. I have all the respect for him. He's very professional, and uh, I wish him all the best. Just maybe one last question. It's not even 1 p.m. So much time left before tomorrow's final. What do you do until then? Yeah, I have a lot to do. Yeah. <laughs>
Apart from recovery. I'm going to have my lunch, I'm going to watch movies, I'm going to go for a walk. I don't think about tomorrow yet. I'm right here, living here, and uh, I mean, it's a Friday. So it's, I, I'm living life, man. It's okay. You like to relax a little bit and go explore? Yeah, yeah sure. Park. I go, I mean, the, where we're staying is a beautiful place. I love that hotel. And uh, there's the sea, you know, there's a lot of things to do. Okay, enjoy. Thank you so much. Good luck, thank you. Thank you.